Okay, so guys, first things first. We need to split Brookhaven into two halves for this epic battle. This time, we got the cameraman and the speaker man versus the skibbity army. Yeah, this guy looks so scary. Okay, so this is gonna be the battlefield where the war takes place. So I think the first thing to do is get ourselves a giant skibbity toilet. This side, but this guy is a giant, so we need to make him bigger. That side, and already, guys, we have our toilet. Now we need to put down one of our cameramen like this guy, but he needs to be big enough to fight him. So I'm gonna get the Titan one because I think he's big enough. And I'm gonna make him the same size. Also, guys, leave a comment in the comment section down below. Who do you think is gonna win this epic battle? Okay, so I'm gonna add a ton more of these guys behind him because one speaker man is not enough to take down that giant toilet over there. That's right. I don't know how many guys I've just put down, but that looks like a lot of speaker men. Also, we're gonna add some of these flying speaker men. This right. I feel like these things are the ultimate weapon. Plus, after the war is over, we can listen to some really good music out of these. Like my favorite song, Bobby Go. Okay, that is not my favorite song. I was just joking. Okay, the speaker side is starting to look really good, but the skibbity side is lacking. But before we do that, guys, I want to check out and see what my friends are doing right now. Okay, it looks like Cory has put in some police skibbity toilets. That's good because they've got to patrol the whole city. And I don't know what Dishy's up to right now, but I think we should keep that a surprise for later. Okay, so just like I did for the other side, I need to add a ton of people for the war because it's not only these titans that are going to fight. We also have an army behind us, skibbities, ready to go to battle. And you know, guys, I wonder what happens if they can't use laser eyes. They just start throwing out doo-doo water. Okay, you guys know how much I hate spiders. I'm literally adding some of these. And I'm telling you, if I was the one in this war, you would not catch me anywhere near these guys. But that is why they're perfect for war, because people are going to be super scared of them. Okay, this battle is starting to look really cool, but it still looks like boring Brookhaven. There must be a way that we can change this somehow. Wait, what? There's, like, custom skibbities. This one literally has guns. Okay, well, I'm gonna turn this into a flying skibbity. Because I think this guy is literally perfect for war. Also, if we're gonna have spider speaker man, I think it's only fair we also have a spider toilet man. Oh, my gosh. I did not expect this one to be this huge. And wait, why do his eyes look like that? That is so creepy. Okay, and there's two spiders. Now, I think it's time for us to start changing things in the map. This side started with skibbity toilet plot pots. Now, I'm just gonna change every single one of these. Okay, and now we've changed all of these to toilets. I think it's only fair that we change all of the black ones to speakers. Okay, and even though this looks really good right now, we still have so much more work to do. Guys, I'm actually gonna delete this fountain because I want to try and create a toilet fountain like this. Oh my gosh. I actually think this looks really good. I'm definitely gonna put my head inside of there. Oh my gosh, that looks so good. Okay, now I think it's time to add more of these flying speakers over here just because it looks like we have too many toilets. Okay, the next thing we just did, guys, is change some of the sides to like club toilet and speaker supplies and i think i'm just gonna change the arcade to skibbity yeah and i, I don't know why <laughs> it literally says skibbity birthdays wait that gives me an idea guys look all of these skibbities are having a happy birthday party literally with minecraft cakes and little hats on their head look how much fun they're having and i even added some speakers in here so they can listen to music and i might even add a creepy spider speaker mode and he can watch them from up here and make sure they don't do anything anything bad. Okay, the next thing I think we need to change is the skibbity, and this one will be really easy. For this one, I'm just gonna replace most of the games in here with speakers, and then we're gonna change these seats right here, and we're gonna replace these with toilet seats, so the people who play this can play toilet games. See, people can literally play toilet games inside of here, guys. Okay, and I've even added a skibbity floor, which is really creepy, but I think this room is actually done now as well, which means it's time for us to move on to the speaker supplies. Okay, guys, I think this speaker supplies is done. I added loads of different flavored ice creams like poop and spit speaker does. But I also added a ton of really cool artwork to the wall, so when they come in and have their really weird ice creams, they get to look at themselves who look pretty cool. Next, we got Club Toilet. I forgot to change this sign. And instead of the VIP, I think we need a toilet sign. Or maybe something like this. Very important toilets. And this will be the area that all the important toilets sit at. And because this is called Club Flush, I'm gonna put, like, toilet water on the walls. Then I'm gonna add a Tiva Mad Bouncer Guard. This guy's gonna make sure there's no trouble between both of these guys. 
guys. The really cool thing about this side is when you look inside it angles and changes to a toilet side. It's almost like the toilets are up to something sus. Oh yeah, there's a Grimace toilet shake as well. And just like that, I think Club Flush is done. And now we're gonna go on to this room here. And I'm pretty sure this one's gonna be super easy. Oh wait, when I move this man, you can see a tiny little head inside of his uh, camera. Why has he got such a small head? Okay, now guys, if you look inside of it, even this room is done. Speak about having their nails painted, getting their hair done. And I think they're even about to get some sort of weird clean done. Anyways, I think it's time to go and see what Corey is up to. As you can see, he's literally filled out like toilets in every single place. Okay, now to make the battle more intense, guys. I'm just gonna add these giant mountains so, like, they literally can't escape. Like, war is literally their only option. That's right, there's literally now nowhere for these guys to go except into battle. Or I guess they can pop into the, uh, shop down here, which is now called wires and cables and protected by these speaker men. Look, it even says no toilets. I guess this is what Dishy's been doing whilst I've been building everything else. Oh my gosh, she even added this whole speakers thing. This is so nice. Wait, I wonder what happens if I put a wall sky in the air. Oh my gosh. That has literally just transformed this whole thing. Okay, well guys, we're getting pretty close now to a finished product, but I do want to make a really cool hotel. And we're going to call it Speaker Stays. It actually looks much better than when it says hotel. So we're going to add this thing, whatever it is, because I like the way it looks. Now we need to add some people that actually work here. And oh my gosh, this guy has a tiny head up there as well. Look. And it looks like he's like a bit of hair on his head as well. Okay, I'm also going to put one of these speakers up on the roof just to scare away the toilets. I mean, I'm not going to lie, guys. That would scare me away as well. That's really creepy. Okay, so I'm going to replace these posts with these speakers. Then I'm also going to change the roof to speakers too. Then I'm going to add some of these speaker guards just to make sure there's no toilets getting involved. Then I'm going to put one of these toilets down in here like he's dead. All right, peace, skibbity. Now I'm just adding some of these guys looking up in the distance because if I came out my hotel and saw a giant speaker man over there, I would probably be looking up at him freaking out too. That's right. I also just see this guy up in the sky. I guess he got added as reinforcements. Now it looks like Corey is doing the inside of this place. He's got someone working here and added a ton of really cool speakers and stuff. And this he's changed this to down the flushes, skibbity groceries. He's even adding toilet paper and toilets. Okay, uh, guys, it looks like Dishy is just wrapping up some animations and stuff right now. He's put some more toilet paper in here and other stuff like plungers and cleaning supplies. Literally, this is like a toilet's dream come true. And I think Corey is just finishing up over here as well. Adding some final details. It looks like he even added a weird ramen, probably with toilet water inside of it. <laughs> Look, he's added a camera inside of this toilet, which is obviously a joke. But yeah, I think at this point, guys, this map is actually complete. I think we're gonna publish this right now and come and play with some of you guys and see what you think of the map. Okay, guys, loads of people have literally just joined my game. Like this big cat wearing a dress. And it looks like they're all checking out right now all of the skibbity toilets. I just said, you like the game? And this guy said, yes! Oh my goodness, thank you so much, Void. I love your avatar. The thing is, these people aren't even checking it out. They're literally just trying to attack me. But there's so many things to see, so you guys should probably check this game out as well. Because there's literally so many cool things. Ah, these guys are actually haunting me. What the heck? Somebody died. This game is a chef's kiss. Mwah. Thank you so much, being bead. Wait, this guy's got yellow merchandise. He's made his own merchandise. This is professional, noob. Oh my gosh. And Dishy is... It. Everyone bounce on Dishy's head. If you ever see Dishy in a game, that's right. Everyone bounce on his head. That's what you get, Dishy, for thinking your biggest. Anyways, guys, come play this game and let me know what you guys think of it. I actually think this is really cool. I think we made a really good battle scene. And yeah, guys, I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!